Expressions are the backbone of item types. But they've also been difficult to determine the right syntax to get at your different civil properties. So we've added a new capability allowing you to browse through the civil properties in a tree-like structure so you can find those properties that you're looking for more easily. So here as I drill down through a geometry feature and into the feature name and grab out the feature name itself. Now you may recognize a little bit of that structure. It's the same structure or hierarchy that we use to define text favorites. So as great as that is, we also wanted to make it a little bit easier so that if you already had an element in your file that had the information on it that you wanted, you could select that element, displaying it in the properties, go to the property that you want, right click and choose copy EC expression. And then I could paste that into my file. So you'll see it's browsed and found the exact same expression. Or maybe I went and picked a different property. I could paste in a different type of expression here, grabbing the feature definition. Or if I grabbed a different element, maybe I went and grabbed this mesh element and I wanted to grab the volume off of it. I could get that same. And you see the similar syntax. I could have browsed to it or I could select it. And just for one last element here, let's go pick a drainage node and maybe we wanted to pick up the invert elevation off of that. So a lot of power either to type in your expressions or to copy and paste your expressions into the expression builder.